I am declaring it right fucking now. I'm risking so much to do this. It's kind of sad, like I'm kind of tearing up. <laughs> Let's talk. It has finally become clear to me that things need to change drastically. Something has just not felt all the way right with my work, with my business, with my channel, with all of the things that I do, the content that I'm making, and I haven't been able to pinpoint it exactly until recently, thanks to Mercury going direct. So here's the deal. Something has just not fucking felt right. As this year has been progressing and as I've been growing and evolving and my interests have been changing, my interests are always under the umbrella of spirituality and and healing. I feel like it's been really difficult for me to stay consistent with the horoscopes for a couple years now because I go through these phases where I get into it again for a little bit and then I'm kind of not into it anymore. As much as I love astrology, as much as I like tarot, I don't want to just be a horoscope girl. I don't want to just be the girl that you come to to get your horoscope for the month ahead because really what these horoscopes, what they actually provide me with is a way to do what I really am passionate about. So really they're just a cover-up to do what I really want to do and that's share powerful messages that I really don't need tarot for or astrology for like they happen naturally for me I'm just using those kinds of videos to do that I am no longer going to be Tawny Michelle tarology and as much as I love astrology and we'll still talk about it and we'll still do videos on it likely and occasionally do new moon and full moon horoscopes I'm not really going to be doing much other than that. And this is why. I don't want to just be a horoscope girl. Like I said, as much as I love astrology, it's just not what I really feel called to do. I'm still going to be offering readings on my website for an amount of time. I'm also going to be revamping my easy foundational relatable astrology course for beginners. I'm going to be offering that over on my Patreon for the top tier if you're interested. So this year, I have really gotten into a lot of other spiritual topics, such as manifestation, the hermetic principles and laws, energetics, quantum manifestation, healing, inner child work, abundance as well. Like these things I've always been into, but they've really taken off this year. And I really feel like these things are what I am feeling so called to do more with. So I want to start creating videos and documenting my own journey. Here's the thing. I am about to take off. I am declaring it right fucking now that something big is about to happen. I'm about to literally start making my dream life happen and it's been in the making all year. Like I've been getting glimpses and evidence of it working throughout the year, but I am about to like literally make shit happen because I'm taking my power back. There for a while I was letting a lot of my thoughts, my self-doubts, what other people may think dictate what I was going to fucking do. I want this video not to just be me telling you that my channel is about to change and everything's about to change for me, but I want this video to inspire you too. Because for a long time, I've been feeling this way, but was scared to change because the best videos on my channel, the videos that got the most support and views were my horoscope and tarot videos, my sign horoscope videos. But honestly, they're not doing too hot now. It's I have been inconsistent and that usually happens when I'm not insistent. But here's another thing with tarot and astrology. Like with tarot and astrology horoscope videos, once that video is over, once that month is over, it's basically like done, right? Like not many people are going to go back and watch that content. And this is not like the only reason that I'm not doing them. Like this really isn't even a reason. But the real reason of it, this video I feel like is all over the place, but the real reason of it is I'm actually passionate about the messages that I share in each reading more so than using astrology and tarot to get there, right? Like I can get there on my own. I don't need all this stuff to get there. I'm like cutting out the middleman. The videos that I really want to start doing are videos of things that I'm actually really passionate about and really interested in under the umbrella of spirituality and healing. I change a lot. I go through a lot of transformations. I have a lot more than just one interest. I'm not I'm not a person that can stick to one thing forever. Like I'm just not that person. It's why I've never really been able to hold a normal job because I like 
a lot of variety. I like options. I like to be able to have the freedom to explore different things. I don't feel like I can do that on my channel. And so I know some of the videos that I do starting out may not get as many views, but I'm okay with that. I've gotten to the point where I've accepted that. I'm okay with that. If you don't want to watch anymore, that is 100% fucking fine. You do you, right? I am just doing me and I'm doing what feels right and what feels aligned and purposeful for me. And that's what I want. Like, I want this video to be an inspiration for you because if you have that little voice inside of you that's been telling you, like, it's disturbed, that something isn't right, that there's some kind of discomfort in your life, that you're feeling like burnt out on something over and over and over and over again. And yeah, it's gonna be scary to change it. It's going to be scary to possibly not get as many people watching my shit as there once was. But maybe that is something that you should do. 2022 is showing us our dream lives. 2022 is showing us where we have certain dreams that maybe we've put off or maybe we haven't fulfilled. And this is an opportunity to start doing that, to really start tapping into that and not just ignoring it because of our old fears, right? There's a lot of past versions of us that are holding us back right now out of fear, out of lack, out of scarcity, right? And so those are the things that I want to fucking talk about. And they do align with the astrology. So I will still talk about astrology at least monthly, right? Right? and over on my Patreon. <laughs> but I'm not going to do sign horoscopes, monthly sign horoscopes. I just did that big long reading. It took me literally two whole entire days. I did nothing but work on the sign readings for this month. I just don't feel like it was really worth it. I don't feel like people are even really that into it, you know? I mean, I could be wrong, but it's not even about that. I am, it's not worth it to me. It doesn't feel right to me. I hope that this video is like maybe inspiration for you to be like, I'm stepping in my power and I'm done letting my circumstances, I'm done letting my mind, my doubts, my thoughts, other people control my fucking destiny right now. I am stepping into my power and making that fucking decision because that's where it all fucking starts. And if you want to hear more about any of the things that I'm talking about right now, let me know down below. I already have a ton of stuff planned, a ton of video ideas planned, but if there's anything that you would like to start seeing from me, let me know. But I really want to document my process to manifesting my dream life. That is really what I want to do and talk about all the things that I've learned, all the things that I know in between. And for now, I am still offering astrological readings below on my website. And like I said, I'm going to be teaching easy, relatable astrology again and revamping my astrological course over on Patreon. If you want to learn yourself and your chart, which astrology is amazing for, I've learned so much about myself and my life and my own purpose through astrology. Like the reason a lot of this is happening is because I have Saturn moving across my moon. I have my Saturn, I'm coming out of my Saturn return. I don't want to just be like, I don't know. It just, it feels like I've grown past it, right? And this is no shade to anybody that's like doing horoscopes and around my age or older than me like that. I'm not saying it's immature to do that. I just, for me, it doesn't feel like me anymore. That's what I'm trying to say. It feels like I've grown past that version of me that started with tarot and astrology. And it's like, it's kind of sad. Like I'm kind of tearing up. <laughs> I did not expect to cry in this video. <laughs> Feeling the feelings and letting it out. <laughs> did not expect to cry. You did not expect to cry. Whoa. Um, it feels like I've grown past and evolved past the version of me that that does tarot and astrology. And so I am just at a place now where I don't feel I need those tools as much, if that makes sense. So I want to use this channel in a new way, and I'm still probably going to do maybe like new moon or full moon horoscopes because I do like doing new moon and full moon horoscopes but I'm done with the monthlies. I just, I'm not doing it anymore. It's just not where my heart's at. And I think other people can feel that. I think it's just, it's not what I wanna do. So I'm going to start doing different content, still spiritual based, still healing based. And so it would really mean a lot to me if you do wanna stick with me, if you do 
relate to me or like my content if you could share the new content i come out with you know share it with different people etc it would really really mean a lot to me because i feel like I have such a powerful story. I have so many powerful stories. I have a powerful background. I came from literally nothing. I came from literally nothing. I was addicted to drugs. I was literally just in hell, like literally in hell. And so finding spirituality has saved my fucking life and finding astrology has saved my life and being able to learn about myself through those tools and being able to share them on a platform with other people that actually relate to me and that actually give a fuck is like so freaking like meaningful to me and I just want to be myself I just want to be authentic and this is what feels authentic right now so I hope that you guys can understand and if you've been feeling something that doesn't quite feel right in your life this is your chance to go for something bigger because that little voice inside of you is telling you that you were meant for more that you deserve better right that it's not that this is all that you can do it's not that this is all like that you have to settle for something because there's so many ideas in my head of like oh well, i have to keep doing these horoscopes for a little bit because that's what's going to you know bring in the same amount of money that i you know make and this that and the other and it's like no like screw that i'm going out on a whim here i'm risking so much to do this but this is what feels aligned hopefully this is inspiring in some way to you as well like if there's been something that's been really bothering you and you feel like you were meant for more you feel like you were meant for bigger things it doesn't feel something doesn't feel aligned anymore then you were meant for more there is something else out there for you and no matter what happens from here if people quit watching whatever i'm gonna keep doing it because i believe in myself and i value my authenticity and my inner power and that is what is more important to me so i love you guys thank you for watching this let me know if you stayed all the way till the end i did not expect to cry i really was like not even emotional uh, about this i was actually like excited but really nervous been working through a lot of like old versions of me and it's been really beautiful and i just want to share so much about healing and the healing journey and spirituality and manifestation and energetics and like I have so much I want to share with you, and so I hope that a lot of you will stay and still watch. Like I said, I will still have new and full moon horoscopes occasionally, and I am going to be starting my astrological course over on Patreon. And uh, yeah, thank you guys. I love you, and I will see you soon in a very different kind of video.